Do you want to have a rounded rectangle mask just like this? Then this video is for you. Hey guys, this is James and welcome to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. This is a very quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can make a rounded rectangle mask using Adobe Premiere Pro. There are several methods to do that. I am going to show you the simplest method. So first let's open Adobe Premiere Pro. Here is a video. I want to have a rounded rectangle crop on this video. To do that, I need to open FX control panel. If you don't see FX control panel, then go to Windows then just enable fx control then you will have a option just like this under fx control panel you will have a option called opacity and here you will have rounded mask and then rectangle mask just click on this rectangle mask icon then you will have a mask just like that maybe you want to increase the size of your mask depending on your needs and your video i want to increase the size of this mask so i need to go to a point and just press shift then you'll have a two-sided arrow just like this if you see this two-sided arrow then click and drag this side just like that then it will increase the size of your mask so i want a mask size just like that now if you watch closely then you will see there are some feathering going on here so if you just want to reduce the feather you can reduce the feather from the mask feather size now here is the trick i want to have a rounded rectangle mask to have a rounded rectangle mask i need to expand the mask under opacity you will have a option called mask and under mask you will see mask expansion just increase the value of mask expansion then you will get a mask just like that which is a rounded rectangle mask if you want to have a vintage look then you can just increase the mask feather just like that then the side of your mask will have some vintage look and if you want to have a sharp rounded rectangle mask then just reduce the mask feather by zero so there this is the way you can make a rounded rectangle mask very easily in adobe premiere pro that's all for today i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel then you can subscribe to this channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye